to Florida. Marcotte in the powder blue trunks and Sugar Ray Leonard with his red, white, and blue. Right now I see Sugar moving around quite a bit. What he's doing, he's trying to get the man, get the break. Got six rounds on Friday. I don't think he missed five punches in five. Says uh, if it weren't for boxing, he wouldn't mind being a gym. Doing much trying to get the distance. Now he has the distance. He's going to do a lot of combinations. By Leonard in the final seconds of round one. Round two in a big house at the convention center Miami Beach. In case you just joined us. Okay, threw a good punch. Sugar Ray leaned back and countered with a jab. Oh, that left hand land. Very good right there. Well, Leonard isn't the one punch Charlie, but his... Round three. Body punches, which is the only thing that he can do. He cannot afford to stay outside. Good uppercut by Leonard. The sugar stone right now, they're good starts. Body punches right on the elbow. Good right hand. Everything is. But Leonard bearing down, constantly pressuring Mark Able to land cleanly. Rarely does he deliver a punch. Of course, the face of Leonard shows that. Cotts eye. They stopped the bleeding there, but they were not able to stop the bleeding from the nose. Oh, a solid left hand. That's right. Might be interesting to get uh, Leonard to enter, uh, interview Leonard. There's a punching bag here in round four. Oh, half a minute remaining in round. His only hope is to land a big left hook. Round five from Miami Beach Convention Center. Round five. Except on that one good bomb. Halfway through round five. It's scheduled for ten. If it goes after six rounds. We feel then we might have that opening in the one big punch in the final minute. Very good jab right hand. One, two. Dude to get it. You saw that left jab was there and Marcotte after the punch had been there. Oh, right hand. Puts Marcotte down. Round five. Very good right hand. Right hand lead. Round six, and you have the feeling as this fight has developed that they were picked off by Leonard. He rolled with the right hand, he caught the hook. Again, although it certainly was late in his amateur career, he had 150 fights. Oh! Double right hand. Scott seeing all those left hands, wondered where that other extra hand was coming from. How do you stop Sugar Ray Leonard? That was about it. The Bob Donner, two, comes up and get hit by three. Oh, Marcotte lands a right hand. That's a bleeding from the nose. Has to be very difficult for him to breathe. And he's bleeding over the eye. But he can't do it. He goes the right hand and gets hit with four punches. Time has been stopped. That's not the... Hit him with a lead right hand and a good one, two. A little French pastry now by Sugar Ray. I want to get up and answer this bell. This is number seven. Big day on NBC Sports. We have the wide open action that will follow Sports World. Certainly rooting him back to answer the next bell. That's true, Bob. The first time is very sick. I was being bad, but then again, Sugar's going to get right hand. That was a good leaping hook by Sugar. But Marcotte can take a punch. When a man is totally out of class, I think it's beautiful him to keep trying. <laughs> Closes Leonard to a championship fight himself. He's been brought along. Round eight. And the doctor after exam. Pepino Cuevas uh, or Wilfredo Benitez, the two welterweight champions. Wouldn't that be a match? Leonard against Cuevas, the way that Cuevas will take four punches to land that one big. That would be a good fight later on. I think it's no question about what Leonard's going to have. Those punches is going to make up for that extra strength. Incredible. survive the count. The winner is Sugar Ray Leonard. They've stopped the fight.